Bro, what is... Oh, okay. <laughs> Where the fuck is everyone? The same people oh, that my God. fucking rolled up on me. <laughs> so I'm like, how motherfucking dumb can you be that you like pretending like shit's over when you're actually faking it? You know what I mean? Like, who the fuck ever going to believe you again? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, what a okay. K. What up, what up, baby? It's okay. This place oh. is pretty fucking sick. It's it pretty dope. Have you seen this before? First things first, who's got some food and drinks over here? I got food and drink, mate. You're good. There you go, mate. I've got water and food right there for you. Mm, you're on a french fry diet. I can gun through the kind of the checklist there, Kate. Um, you ready? Yeah. So what's uh, what's going on? What's the deal here? All right. So, uh, first and foremost, um, the crew called Gang Gang. We talked to them. They also were trying to hit the regulator warehouse like early yesterday before storm. Um, they also open to the idea because it turned out that their leader someone that i met like five weeks ago we recognize each other and he opened to doing work if necessary like we're talking contract work so you want someone pick up someone worked or something like that uh he down for that mm. second thing i want a little tug stack a little what now i want a little tug stack yeah yeah can we put that request in Oh, damn. Oh, wait, wait. I mean, I, I'll take my uh, myself out there, OG. Don't say that. No, I I mean, to be honest, yeah, that happened on, when we fought, shot. Like, I actually blew myself up, but we're going to pretend right, that never happened. Get the job done, then. Um, second thing is Sterling, who uh, spoke to Ramos yesterday. Uh, he called me again this morning, and I'm like, so why are you talking to me like you already spoke to them or whatever? And he like, well, you know, just in case it don't go through, we went forward with it. And he's saying him and seven other motherfuckers left the regulator. Now, hold your thoughts on that for a second, because this get juicy. The Sterling, the dude that been wearing the peacock, little peacock, like a little winter jacket or whatever. Uh -huh. But he also the motherfucker that was on one of the rooftop last night. So, like, he really been playing this, like, He's out, he's in, he's out, he's in. I then told him, like, okay, listen, for benefit of doubt, let's say I, like, believe you for a second, you're trying to do your own shit. Because he was on that, I want to talk to, like, you know, he wants, like, uh, the shit to have a bit more meaning is, like, what he was trying to get at. Mm -hmm. I'm like, all right, well, who's you with and who's over there? And he tells me it DK is with him. I'm like, DK, that motherfucking dumbass that I put a gun in his mouth, and he thought it was a water soaker. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, <laughs> I don't know what you... And he the same dude who spit in our face when he said he ain't paying up the money he agreed to pay at the Yellow Jack. Mm. So how are you going to pick him up and then be like, yo, we leaving that old shit behind? He's like, listen, DK um, maybe learned, like, learned his ways from the regulator and I'm going to fix him and we're moving away. What wreck like, did he get to for the houses? Right, you know, whatever. You, uh, you know, I ain't making any calls here, but you go in like, you know, uh, you know, what, whatever happened tonight happened tonight, but you know, I appreciate the call or whatever. Now he in his good grace or whatever you want to call it, not good grace, but like as a show of like trust, I guess said that the regulators got AK 40 my sevens that, and that was like his way to be like, yo, I'm being like serious about this now i would not have necessarily believed it but the people i met with this morning said they were looking for rifle ammo so i and and so now i'm thinking sterling actually ain't lying about that because now there's a different person saying that they're looking for rifle ammo and he said that if we didn't see sterling said if we didn't see the ak yesterday We's probably going to be seeing it today. Now, whether that happened or not, we'll see. But Oh, like we're getting a free AK? Nice. No, like, yeah. no. Oh, oh. 
Yeah, like we might be getting AK, bro. How? We got an AK, nice. Uh, to add to that, Tugs, one of my. Oh, you see the guy at the AK zone? Just run him over with your car and take that shit. <laughs> Yo. Uh, yeah, to quantify that, one of my little birdies in Mirror Park said he saw two regulators holding AKs yesterday. Okay. Yesterday? We were fucking them up yesterday, though. I guess they kept them hidden, not wanting to use them yesterday. Maybe they used, Maybe they had no ammo. Maybe they got the Yeah, maybe they had no ammo. ammo. I don't know. Hmm. Now, here the problem with Sterling, though, is that just earlier, about two hours ago, he rolled up on Conjo and was trying to look. He rolled up on him, and they were like, who is you, who is you, who is you? And they were looking for a quote-unquote little girl. Where he, Conjo, think he referring to me because they want to clap my cheeks. I think that's what they were turning into. I think they think I cute or something like that. And I'm like, listen, if that's going to be how the war end, I ain't down with that shit. I just want to be clear. But he just sent me photo, the one I put in the IRC. The people that went at him, they're driving in a black, uh, 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 what, what is it? Like the Cadillac CTS. Um, those are Sterling and his people. So, mm. uh, Chad, like you've heard this story. It, you put it the best way. How, how do you describe what happened? How I see the situation, right? Is these two fucks, at least DK and the other guy that met us at Yellow Jack the one time, right? With still no respect, still being smart asses, right? Just pleading, telling us over and over. They're regulators anymore right they're not fucking with them anymore and two days go by and over the course of these two days we get photographs of them all still together still doing shit i mean it sounds like just a bunch of fucking bullshit yeah to right me. now Until we see something who's, change, the, who's even the leader i don't even sterling i guess sterling maybe is the leader of the split offs and flowers is the leader of the but until players. we see any sort of action from them that that speaks otherwise i consider them all to be regulators and i'm not letting off the fucking gas to add a bit more uh, uh, to what this ex regulators were up to, you know the old static block off uh, Vista, you know the one opposite the uh, multi story? Uh huh. So they, they want to move in there. They're looking to move into that turf. There's a new gang that have already set up there. So I know that they were driving around trying to find some of this new gang to speak to and try and figure out how they could kick them out and then move in. I don't know if that's what they're looking for when they say little girl or if they are indeed referencing you, Tugs. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Sterling, Sterling keep blowing up my phone. And I did kind of like question him a little bit about it. Or like, you looking for someone? He denying all of it. So I'm like on the, I'm a, I'm a pretty sussy baka on him right now. Uh, Like, even if I were to take like what he's saying, like, sirs. One other thing, what? sussy baka. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's, some it's like Chewbacca, shit. but you like yeah. sus. Yeah, some shit in college, they do. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah. Uh, what else? You know that vehicle, the weed one, that yeah. we tried to chase yesterday? Uh, we think we found a warehouse and a vehicle. Oh, shit. We ran into some random ass motherfucker we got to talk in. Um, and... This dude was added to a group because they needed, they were trying to do something, but they needed five. And he ended up showing a location. We went to the location because we're like, what the fuck are you talking about right now? We go to location and that vehicle that we chased, you know, the little like light blue one with the wheat, the, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, the when baby we found blue one at the weed van? It's sitting right there, bro. Well, shit. I mean, there we go. Yeah, yeah. All right. Maybe we'll try to see if we can hit that today. Get the warehouse back up for Chody and Raymond. So what I'm curious about is how the fuck they got their hands on AKs in the first place. Uh, the vendor, to find, man. who I think just showed up at our warehouse. Hmm. So I up. think we should all roll up there. Us five. Give it a little look. Okay. I think he yeah, yeah. around. Should I call him? Just I think there? he just went to sleep. Oh, okay, okay. All right, let's roll out. You boys are four right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs>